We didn't tell David Best, we want you to work on the Broad Street Bridge. We didn't even identify it as a site necessarily, but he selected it. And then when he did, our excitement level began to, to really increase. Because the Broad Street Bridge was, was designed to have sculptures on it, those four plinths at the end, were, that was part of the design, and the bridge has been there since the early 90s. So this is the first time sculptures are going up. We really liked that he noticed the Levesque Tower in the background, and that's really the Columbus icon, I think, in terms of architecture, and that's one of the inspirations for him. So repeating that four times, roughly, and uh, in some ways in spirit, and marking these in a very kind of ceremonial, elegant, um, elegant and playful at the same time way seems really appropriate for, for this occasion. We're really excited that it's a, it's a prominent site and that he is able to work at a scale that we think you know, works on something that big. Such a beautiful river and such a beautiful bridge. And I think what we've done with it is accessible enough. You know, it's not, it's not too intellectual, you know, it's just kind of a decorative thing on it. I worked with the city and the county officials on this, and they were the most gracious. I mean, just to the point of almost making myself and the crew come almost to tears. They were so gracious to us. I think it's important for people to contribute to the arts, but I also think the arts have to have, the artists and the arts have to have a responsibility to the community that they're working with. This was, this was a low budget. This is very, very low budget. We'll find out whether people like it or not, I don't know. You know, it was fun to do and it looks kind of pretty out there, so we'll see how it goes. But thank you all for having me here.